Hi everybody. I just really want to show you this really cool jar of raisins I got. Look how pretty it is. It's really expensive and amazing. Isn't it pretty? It's actually not really expensive. It's just basic raisins, but it looks really expensive, doesn't, doesn't it? I like, as part of my uh, money-saving mind frame to, uh, or mindset I should say, is to put cheap products in pretty looking jars and then it doesn't make it seem so cheap. I actually do this quite a bit because we, are, we pay a lot for our packaging. I was looking online a little bit earlier and a third um, at least of the packaging or of the product that we pay for is actually just the packaging. We're not paying for, or a third of what we pay for is just the outside cover, not the product. And it's probably more than that. So what I like to do is I like to put just normal, ordinary things into pretty jars. And this jar originally was a jar of honey. So once we ate all the honey, um, we cleaned it out and put other pretty things in it, such as marshmallows, just Sainsbury's marshmallows, homemade hot chocolate. That's another money saving idea there, homemade hot chocolate. And what you can do, just take a normal jar when you're finished with your pasta sauce or whatever thing comes in a jar, clean it out, put it in your dishwasher, make sure it's really, really jar dry, and then um, fill it with your, take off the label, because the labels are ugly. Um, if, the, if there's any glue left on the jar, just take a bit of olive oil and dish soap and kind of rub it out. You can rub off that remaining glue and it leaves you with a really clean jar. Another thing I've done that with is my instant coffee. This was, this was a, a coffee jar, a more expensive coffee um, a couple years ago probably. And now I just buy a cheaper brand of instant coffee and put it in my pretty jar. Do it with popcorn. I do it with lentils. Another reason I put things in jars is it looks um, pretty when you open up the cabinets and you see all the jars, but also you can find things easier. You're not having these bags just kind of willy-nilly in the cupboard kind of falling over on each other. You can stack them and things are a lot easier to find in the cupboard so that also then you can find things in the cupboard and you don't need to rebuy things. So there's lots of benefits to the jars. Um, again, doesn't mean you have to always buy the cheapest thing, but for instance, these raisins aren't cheaper at Sainsbury's than they are at Aldi. And the package is simpler, but it's pretty. And I think that's what we have to do to change our mind frame a little bit to save some money.